going to show you some wonderful weapons throughout history. Starting off with the stick. This stick may look like your average stick you find outside. <laughs> but to the Native Americans, this was the Native Americans, this was their bread and butter. And the Native Americans, this was their bread and butter. Now, they would use this as a multi-purpose tool, like a spear, bow and arrow, a fishing rod, and they would, they would also, they would, they would, um, yeah. Next, we have the sword. Now, I know what you're thinking. This does look like the stick I had a few seconds ago, but no one cares what you think. The sword originated in Asia for close-range samurai warfare, where it was adapted in Europe, where some generals would use it on horseback. Plain, bliss, and simple. Nice catch. Now, when swords didn't cut it, we had military great knife. It may say Chicago culinary, but no one cares what you think. This was used mainly close range. One jab, you're dead. Yeah, stabbing. And it was also used for gutting fish if you wanted to go fishing after battle. My lovely assistant. Come on, sweet cheeks. Close range didn't cut it. Anyway, do something a little bit more painful. We got guns. This right here is the cult. It looks like your average pistol, but we're imagining, so it's a cult. This was used around World War I as a sidearm. Bow! You're done, yeah. Is this thing loaded? It is most definitely loaded. Well, we're pretty much done here, because I don't have any more weapons, and I think I'm going to research. So I'll see you guys on the flip side. Deuce! <laughs> Bank.